you are welcome to Abaddon Beach. That's me, Sherry, representing. Welcome to Sierra. <laughs> Of course, it was great to meet everyone again because we had had such an amazing week um, in October and we just made really strong bonds. This was my first time performing abroad with musicians that I didn't come with. They were just so good. They're such professionals that you feel like you're really confident in their hands. As soon as we started rehearsing the songs, I just was amazed how good they were. So I think the rehearsals were really nice moments for us all to realize that we had you know, made something special. I'm a free and cut band who just played for hours. I mean, I've never seen that kind of stamina in anywhere in the world. Um, they're so hardworking and so focused and so talented and gifted. And they're world class. They're world class. We had a more collaborative and improvised editing session where we were playing the tune through and then just running through and testing ideas. It was fun. I guess the idea for that was to finesse some songs that we we started in October and try and get them to like a stage of completion. So that's something we need like a like a. Like a you like a really, really traditional African something like yeah. talking oh, drum. Everybody like collecting everybody. Hello, <laughs> far. The queen is a lot of person. Hello, far. I saw. Then, 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 so we are at Palanta Music School in Freetown um, and I'm here to meet some students so uh, trombone and trumpet players See if they can uh, play with us at the festival, at the Freetown Music Festival. I just love meeting them and uh, so I think we uh, connected right away. Although we're from two different cultural planets, it's, you know, you, you, you belong to the same family when you are a musician. Oh, today we're having Freetown Music Festival, you know. How you Fine. feeling? Like, yes, I'm you ready? ready? Yeah, we're ready. Yeah, we're ready. Than I ever been. I'm done with the L's, I'll forever win. Within the scenario, you know, being there at the, on this beach with the Atlantic Ocean on one side and, and, you know, the city on the other side, and it's an amazing, amazing place. And, you know, it's such a cool venue, uh, like a cool place for this festival. I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm and I'm ready, ready in the positive energy. That's it, till the next scene, life is a movie, buy a ticket for the best seat, where the nights are
That's what I like that in Sierra Leone people just, they just dance when they hear music so that's their form of being a part of the music for us the shy Icelandic people that like are always stiff in the corner you know <laughs> that was like interesting to see how music there is also made for the listeners to like enjoy and, and dance to it the days in Sierra Leone always remind me of just the reason why I got into music to begin with. Just the passion that they have for the music, for their artistry, what they do. I take away with me the reminder of it, it's not a given to be in music, to keep my head up and to keep the energy up and to be positive. For me, it's given me more faith in the possibility that I can have a connection with my country in a way which I'm there as me and true to myself. It makes me feel like I can maintain those connections and build something with people in Sierra Leone and also just around West Africa generally. Get the money, where the rain or sunny, what do you know?